Hi, everybody. All right. You join me for the final of the vinyl. Here I've got the right uh, flap going on, the vinyl's going on it. And uh, the reason I wanted to show this to you is this is a, an important lesson if you're going to be doing vinyl. Almost inevitably, it will always be easier to do the piece that you're trying to wrap if it's on the plane. Now the aileron, you definitely have to take it off, but the flap, this is a, this is a great piece that all you have to do is unlink the push rod from the mechanism at the, at, the, at the fuselage, and it just hangs down like this, and it is so much easier. So my suggestion is to do that. <clears throat> okay, but we got many things to do in this video. One, a uh, quick update. Oshkosh is this next weekend. I will be there basically seven days and eight hours from now. Um, again, I'm not flying in, but I will be around every weekday, 5 p.m., me and my friend Liz will be at the Roxy to have a glass of wine, so you can catch me there. Uh, Monday, I'm going to be at this YouTuber's meet and greet. Someone, I got messaged by a couple of people like, hey, you should you should come. So it's at one of the forums. I think it's at like 2.30. It's, it's before the, the Vans Beer Social. So I'm going to pop in there till about 3.15. Every time I always go to the social at 4, like the kegs have already run out, so I'm going to be there at 3, but... I'm going to pop by this uh, meet and greet thing. Uh, Tuesday will be at the Vans new, uh, like what's new at Vans at 8.30. So there's, I'll be I'll be around. I, I Hopefully I'll get to, to, to see everybody. <clears throat> okay, so before we do the final reveal, I wanted to show you something really cool. This friend of mine, Mike, uh, came by. We've been trying to connect for years. He's a builder. He brought me a prototype of a new product that's going to be uh, sold soon. And it's a replacement for the stock alt air door for the snorkel because that was one, that was one piece of kit i never really thought was was really nice and even the, in, the ias that look at it say you know it's just a wire wrapped around a, a screw with a couple of jet nuts to hold it in place i said yeah this is better in fact here's a picture of it see much much nicer black powder coated it's got a uh, free rotating uh, wire lock uh, clamp right so you just take that same wire straighten it out if you can push it through there and use the set screw to hold it in place it goes nowhere in fact here is a video of it articulating I think you would agree a much more superior design to the one that defaults from fans. Uh, they will be available soon for purchase through Aircraft Specialty. That is where I get all of my fuel and oil hoses. They make a superior product uh, and have great customer service. So you'll be able to pick one up from them soon. All right, so let's just go ahead straight to the reveal. It is time to show the plane off and drum roll. Here it is. looking pretty good actually you know what hold on this is this is the wrong picture there's something I left out here's a little something we I decided uh, definitely needed to go up on the tail <laughs> how does that look that's pretty cool huh uh, I couldn't help myself uh, so okay and plus I put a little something on the wing so let's let's go back and show a full picture of the plane again how sweet is that You'll notice also the white roundel on the left wing. <clears throat> it's not exactly perfectly historically accurate. I just really love the idea of having like the cutout white roundel. I mean, you would see that normally in all blue navy planes, but not on the tricolor, but eh, close enough. Close enough for government work. Okay, here's a shot of the front cowling. Now, this is during flight, and as you can see, that matte blue really does a good job. Uh, there is no glare, so just wanted to show you a little after shot. I don't have a good shot of the wing yet. Uh, during flight, I'll get one. Okay, so Oshkosh in a week. Uh, I'll be doing some flying this week before, but again, I won't be flying this baby, and that'll be next year. So uh, to those I'm going to see next week, can't wait. For those that aren't going to be there, wish you could be. Uh, and thank you for joining me, everyone. See you soon.